What's going on, guys? So we're back again, but in an unusual spot. We're in the back of Jimmy's van, making do with this deck profile. We got Perth Pro players Chris Wright here. Came fourth on the weekend <laughs> at the about. regionals. We got Jimmy over here holding What's the life for us. Jimmy, Jimmy Absolute King. legend. Okay. All right, so Chris, my man, what did you play on the weekend? Uh, we played Vertex. We're, we're very exciting. We, Not a surprise. We, we innovate. Not a surprise. We, we change it up. <laughs> innovate, adapt, overcome? Is Absolutely. That? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's it. That's the way. <laughs> <laughs> the one, right. the only Vegex. So what do you reckon, banned or not? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's yeah, got to yeah. be, right? At this point, surely. It's perfectly balanced. No, they, they ban it so you can play Marseille. Exactly right. I yeah. think so. This, right? is, this is the Dex last, last showing, for sure. Yeah, for sure. All right. So for the Dex last showing, what did we play? Let's have a look. All right. Uh, leader is, you mill five cards, you draw cards, you awaken, you draw cards. And then beautiful. you draw cards and mill cards. Yeah, beautiful. Fantastic. That's Easy. the perfect everyone explanation. Knows, everyone knows what Vegex does. That's it. We know Vegex. Get, get out of there. Uh, four of these guys. So four of the free boys. Fantastic. Four. The main chain. Four. These That's are all it. good cards. You play them all free. They all do stuff. Yep. It's 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 reasonably silly. Re reasonably silly. Yeah, I like a it. A little bit silly. How often do you take a life with your trunks? Uh, pretty much all the time. Yeah. Yeah. You just want to be aggressive, right? Yeah. You're trying to kill people. Yeah. All right. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, this is okay. So we have four of these, but let's just. Let's just hide that real quick. <laughs> um, these, this card's very, very unreasonable. Um, the newest part of the deck, everyone probably know what, knows what this does too, but for one energy you're playing a 25k double uh, that attacks and warps any battle card. And you can play it for one and keep it on the field by fusing with it, which is very much unreasonable. So you can hold your overarm for other stuff. Uh, speaking of overarm, uh, we're playing a bunch of this guy, a bunch of this guy, playing one of this guy, uh, this guy, and these guys. Okay, so a lot of overall. A lot yeah. of overall. Well, right. we're trying to kill people. Yep. And we're trying to get cards in the warp so we can fuse them back with this. Mm -hmm. So we want to play enough. Um, this thing attacks twice. It's big. This thing warps the field. This thing is Protection. not really an overall card as much. Yep. Uh, but comes in clutch sometimes. These guys are really just... This guy in particular is just extra names for this. Yes. It sucks. Uh, um, I don't mind it. It it's... sucks. It's a removal, but you don't need it. Yeah, yeah. I, yep. don't, I didn't like it. I didn't like it on the day. Never played it. Yeah, fair enough. Um, this card's great though. This card says when you play it, you are add a good GDT hand. Yeah, yeah. That's, exactly that's right. That's basically all it does. So if you milled it over, you just add it back, which yeah. is nice and comfortable. We're just playing these because they're 30k Goku's and Vegeta's. Yeah. So you can make this. Yeah. Perfect. Uh, perfect. Now is uh, Fighting Fate still MVP of Overrun? Uh, yeah. For you, he's, yeah. He's he's very good. Being yeah. able to go like. Early turn, like turn one, turn two, drop all that, awaken, plus the Gogeta, plus the Fighting Against Plate, plus your free play stuff is... Ridiculous. Very silly. Yes, yes. Uh, we got this guy. Uh, there is... I'm very, we're very prepared for this profile, guys. <laughs> I was going to say, there should be four of this, right? There's definitely four somewhere. Yeah, there's a four somewhere, but there that's okay. Go, yeah, there's your four. Yep, yeah. perfect. Uh, super combo, draws cards, uh, self-awakener that punishes your opponent for defending himself. Yeah. Perfect. And they are also fusion targets for Gogeta. Yes. So we play four of them. Amazing yep. cards. And I think especially in this deck, that Goku kind of shines, right? Like, yeah. just just forcing your opponent to deal with it very early as soon as it hits the board. And most of the time I've seen you set up, like, two, three. So it's very punishing if they it's, try to counter. It's it's very, very good. Yeah, and um, you're being super aggressive. Yeah. They're losing cards. Absolutely. Yep. Uh, oh, there's the fourth one. <laughs> <laughs> perfect, perfect. Uh, one Kai. I'd like to play more, but I couldn't find space. Okay. Um, it's nice to have. Occasionally, the, that Goku doesn't grab back a Gogeta. Occasionally, yep. it grabs back this. Yep, that's which fair. Which is cool. Um, and you don't always kill someone immediately, so having him in the gate is kind of good. Yep, definitely. Uh, for that power, we want more self awaken, and it also punishes your opponent for playing the game. Which yes. Is pretty unfair. Yep. Um, played King Piccolo, and he just sort of went, oh, well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> um, <laughs> yes. It's a good card. Unfortunately, not a Vegeta. That'd be really cool. For no, it would be beautiful. If it was Vegeta. Uh, double quits, kind of main. Um, so many decks get punished by this really hard. And yep. King Piccolo player again <laughs> felt bad resolving this each in each game, but um, it's it's really good. It cycles your hand, which is occasionally relevant, but also just punishes your opponent for, yep. for trying to defend themselves. Especially if they're going to try to topo. Mm. Yeah, that's yeah. when it punishes. When you know they have to topo yeah. or something like that, that's when it's punishing. It's very good for sure. Uh, we're playing we're playing three. Th that's what the sleeve was. Fantastic. Uh, we're playing three <laughs> of these. <laughs> not four. You used to play four. Yep. Now you got the Gogeta. It's double itself, so you don't need as many. Yep. Um, and you want to. You're bricking on too many of them. Honestly, mm -hmm. honestly, two will probably be about right. Yep. Uh, fantastic. Get rid of this. Uh, four power burst. Uh, four power burst is great. It's honestly more often a self awakener than, than a negate. 
um, and it gets back half your deck. Yep. Um, and like I said, very prepared. There was a Heron was lineage seeker around the deck. <laughs> But it's also a very bear. strong, very uh, strong card. Very strong card. The best yep. thing about say about Herons, and one of the best things about Vegex is your entire deck is alive on one energy. Yes. So you just charge the two, and you can do anything you want. Perfect. But your opponent can't Herons you back. That's it. That's um, it. Yeah, I did that the entire day. <laughs> so as long as they can't steal your stuff, you're safe. I did. Yeah, it was it was yep. great. I was stealing their shit. They couldn't touch mine. It was it was awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Did you have side. We got yeah, a side on us. I never touched it. We never touched a side. It's Vegex. So it was consistent you, enough. Awesome. You don't, you don't need a side for Vegex. We don't need, yeah, you don't uh, need a side for Vegex. Never use when you mill consistently, right. you don't need sides. There we go, guys. That was Chris's deck profile. Any shout outs before we go, my man? Uh, yeah, shout out to the team. We all did great in the day. It was a fun day. Uh, and of course, shout out to Team Card Titan. Uh, go buy some copies of Gogeta on their auction page. Yeah, for sure. Definitely a good place to get those uh, Gogetas because they're going to get expensive, I can tell you that. Yeah. yeah, awesome. Thank you, guys. If you guys like this content, please remember to subscribe, hit that bell to stay notified, and we'll catch you guys on the next one. Chilling from the uh, back of uh, Jimmy's van. That's from it, boys.